So for this video, we are gonna do a boxy charm unboxing of the February box. So we'll look inside and see if it's the variation that I've been wanting or and see what we get. So let's open up the box. So the box, you open it, it comes like this, and you have products inside and your card that tells you how much each product is. And we'll add up that at the very end. So everybody in this box gets the Better Than Sex Mascara from Too Faced. And the No Pore Blem Primer from Touch and Soul. So we'll see. Hopefully these are good products. I actually will love the Better Than Sex Mascara. I have my own already. So this will just be a backup to the one I have. I have never tried Touch and Soul brand, so we'll see how that goes. So I did get the box I wanted. It has the Coco Cabana Cream from Sol de Janeiro. De Janeiro. <laughs> I can't talk. So it looks like this. You have it all. It comes with also the Nude Stick Copper Foil. It's like an eyeshadow stick, I think. A magnetic luminous eye color. So that's what it looks like. And then, well, this is very disappointing. I have some pretty vulgar bronzer in bronze mannequin, but it's all broken. So it's very disappointing, especially since I've seen it a lot this month that there's been a lot of broken, pretty vulgar highlighters and bronzers. It's just weird that it's as mini as it is this time. So will send me a replacement, but we'll see what they do. Um, I've heard some stories where people don't actually get their replacements. So, we will test. I'm not going to actually test any of this stuff on my face, but we'll see how it goes. Let's see the primer. So, it actually has like a very hydrating feel, but then definitely smooths out your skin which I actually really like for the winter time where I live it is just bad in the winter for dry skin okay next we will open up Coco Cabana Cream I never actually used anything from this brand so we'll see if it's good Part. It smells really good. It smells just like the beach, which I love. I was born in Hawaii, so I love the beach. Let's see. Ooh, it's a really nice lotion that will probably be using a lot and then get more over the summer just because it smells so freaking good. I love it. Thankfully, my husband loves the smell of coconut. So, like I said, I do have the Better Than Sex Month here. I love it. Love how I'll open up um, when I actually have own so you can see the wand, which I think is my favorite part about it, is the wand just has the perfect bristle and the shape. It's the hourglass shape. Gives your eyelashes the most up and out and full look and long and just beautiful. So yes, I do love that mascara and this will be my backup. Okay. Last but not least of the things I get to try. Is the nude stick. And I'm a sucker for nudes and golds and all that such. And that is so pretty. Like it just glides on and it's just beautiful. I love it. I will definitely use it on my eyes and a look coming up. So that's all of the products that I had. So 
so oh my goodness you can tell this stuff got everywhere lovely it's just everywhere so we have so the Too Faced Spell and Sex Mascara goes for 24 the Pretty Vulgar Bronzer goes to 32 so that brings us up to 56 the Touch and Soul, soul. No, no poor blim from I can't talk is 18 so that brings us up to 74 the sold the Janeiro Coca Cabana cream goes for 20 so that is 94 and the nude stick also goes for 24 so that brings us up to One fourteen? No. One eighteen. <laughs> I can do my eyes swear. Yeah. One eighteen. So it's one eighteen for the whole box. So that's all of the items in the boxy charm box for February next month. I hope that I get the boxy luxe box and there'll be a whole bunch more products to show you. And hopefully I don't have any broken items, which I don't really like. It's a pet peeve of mine, especially with makeup. I know it's gonna break, but companies need to do more to not make their products break so often. And especially with girls, we're gonna travel for their makeup. We're gonna use all this makeup a lot, so making products that don't break so easily like this was packaged pretty good look at the packaging it's got a box it was inside this foam the only thing i could say is put in box or something like so that it doesn't move around or make the wrapping on these products like have tape and stuff so that it doesn't break so hopefully BoxyCharm can figure out their shipping with that and stuff that's more powdery and palettes like that and compacts, they can actually make it so they don't break <laughs> when they get to you. Then they wouldn't have to replace all these items that break. So that's all the time we have. So I'll see you soon in my next video and bye for now.